Welcome back to Quarantine Cooking, everyone. So it's coming to my attention that I've been showing you how to make all this good food. And the weather is beautiful. There's nothing to do but sit outside in your backyard. And I haven't showed you how to make anything to drink. So this is Quarantine Cooking, cocktail edition. Today, we're going to be making a classic tequila cocktail called the Paloma. All right, so this is what we're going to need. We're gonna need grapefruit juice, lime juice. Make sure you actually buy the fresh fruit. Don't buy the crap in the bottle. It's not gonna be the same. We're gonna need tequilas or alcohol. Make sure you buy the Blanco or the Silver, whatever. Don't buy the Reposado or Añejo. Make sure you have the white tequila. We're gonna sweeten it up with some simple syrup or sugar. And we're gonna top it off with soda. And the rim of our glass is gonna be a salt rim. Juice the grapefruit. Get that grapefruit juice all out. Oh yeah. This is actually the most hardcore juice you've ever seen. Like I feel you like hurt yourself using this thing. So awesome. All right, we got a grapefruit juice squeezed. First thing we're gonna do, get our glass ready, wedge of lime, rim the glass with the lime into the salt kosher salt is the best because it's more bigger grains right okay now we're going to take the ice fill your glass up with ice set that to the side we're going to take our shaker take your shaker full of ice Tequila, we're going to do two ounces of tequila. We're going to do one ounce of simple syrup. Or you can use sugar. If you don't have simple syrup or don't want to make it, you can still put some straight sugar in there. We're going to do... A whole squeeze, half a lime, squeeze a whole lime half in there. Get all that juice in there. And we're gonna do two ounces of grapefruit juice. Now we're gonna shake that up. Strain into our glass. And we're going to top it with soda. Garnish. What's your grapefruit? And there it is. This is the Paloma classic tequila cocktail. Very delicious, especially if you use fresh fruit. Make sure you go for the fresh fruit. If you're outside in the sun, enjoying your quarantine, make us a Paloma. You're going to thank me later. Cheers.